Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team gives you an analysis with the information we got during our half trading day of July 5, 2019. Our objective is to give you alternatives to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. We show you the SP500 ETF and it belongs to the bull normal class. Our analysis shows you a strong opportunity to sell. We are expecting a sell return of 1.1%. This top opportunity has a minimum sell price of $295.96, but we expect a possible sell price of $301.12. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. We show you the NASDAQ 100 ETF and it belongs to the bull normal class. Our analysis shows you a weak opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 1.4%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $190.65, but we expect a possible buy price of $186.27. Let's look at the market sectors table. Our analysis is based on the sectors that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy industrial sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $77.51, but we expect a possible buy price of $76.02. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell consumer staples ETF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $58.97, but we expect a possible sell price of $59.8. Energy Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Occidental Petroleum. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $49.43, but we expect a possible sell price of $50.26. Financial Sector ETF belongs to the Bull Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of financials sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy Berkshire Hathaway. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $212.12, but we expect a possible buy price of $210.83. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell U.S. Bancorp. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 6.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $53.36, but we expect a possible sell price of $54.88. BlackRock was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that BlackRock is a bull normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.9%. You may expect now a sell return of 3.3%. 
we suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $459.42. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $483.38. Charles Schwab was a previous top buyer alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Charles Schwab is a trade high class. In the past, it has given an average buyer return of 1.6%. You may expect now a buyer return of 2.0%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $42.23. But we expect a possible sell price of $42.3. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $35.98. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a mild opportunity to buy Bristol Myers Squibb. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 7.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $46.14. But we expect a possible buy price of $45.47. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Merck Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 8.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $87.07, but we expect a possible sell price of $88.36. We show you the industrial sector ETF and it belongs to the bull normal class. Our analysis shows you a weak opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 3.2%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $77.51. But we expect a possible buy price of $76.02. Let's look at the stocks table of industrials sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a strong opportunity to buy Boeing Company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $361.25, but we expect a possible buy price of $344.52. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell General Electric. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 10.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $10.64, but we expect a possible sell price of $10.71. Materials sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of materials sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy air products chemicals. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $226.2, but we expect a possible buy price of $223.52. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell.
we show you the consumer staples ETF and it belongs to the trade low class. Our analysis shows you a mild opportunity to sell. We are expecting a sell return of 2.5%. This top opportunity has a minimum sell price of $58.97, but we expect a possible sell price of $59.8. Let's look at the stocks table of consumer sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy Netflix Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 8.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $377.12, but we expect a possible buy price of $362.91. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. We show you the technology sector ETF and it belongs to the bull normal class. Our analysis shows you a weak opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 2.6%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $79.47, but we expect a possible buy price of $78.02. Communication sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy Western Digital. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 19.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $47.56, but we expect a possible buy price of $45.7. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Microsoft Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 7.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $138.39, but we expect a possible sell price of $139.53. AT&T was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that AT&T is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.1%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $33.31, but we expect a possible buy price of $33.22. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $34.14. Utilities sector ETF belongs to the bear high class, Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utilities sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good update of our half trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. 
We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.